Alright, let's do this. What's up everyone? Empowered Q is here, bringing you some more League of Legends action. We are going against a Trindamir in the top lane, so kind of an interesting matchup. I think this one's actually... Uh, the start's a little bit tougher for Jax. I don't typically do like the goofy level 1 trade against uh, Trindamir because he just kind of sustains right through it, so instead of missing out on all these minions and everything like that um, and getting aggressive, kind of like to chill for a second. Watch out for his hit. Uh, but we'll probably go a pretty heavy split push type build. Uh, definitely planning on getting a Randuin's Omen. Rewarded. Uh, the thing about it is his spin move is like an 8 second cooldown. And my good my, uh, my E is a 16 second cooldown. So it's a little tough to kind of match the trade there. And then he just sustains up. So if I can keep myself healthy, then... I'll be in a better position. So I can hold this right outside a wave. So, hold my E there. See, that's what I mean. And then you can just kind of hit me. Whack one there. If I get jungle pressure, I think uh, that'll be the best way to try and kill him. But now, this is like the kind of times that I want to try and fight him, though, when his rage is down. it up. Ooh. That was weird. I got stuck in his pole. But well, we got the flash. Okay, so now is the time I want to be... Really aggressive on him. Bring it on. Nice. Cool. So his flash was down. I knew that. And he just did his spit. He had no rage. Sorry, I'm taking that kill, buddy. I need it. <laughs> um, I do think I'm going to go Tiamat first to match kind of his wave clear. Because Trinimir is probably going to do the same thing. Um, and I don't want to constantly get shoved into lane. Because that's what he wants to do is shove. Then Jarvan can kind of uh, gank me and they can dive and with we'll Trindomir ultimate. Not good. Okay. Just wanted to get him to back off a little bit. Don't miss the cannon. Well, now I can back. He won't be able to hold all that. Use teleport too, and that's just enough for my Tiamat. Perfect. Head back to top lane. Surprise, I'm back. Yeah. Nice to push under tower. So a spidget behind in CS, but that's cool. Missed a couple CS on that goofy play. Uh, but yeah, Rando and Zoban will be good. There's got a lot of damage here. I might go Bramble Vest as well. I don't really want to go that tanky, but Callista gets a lot of healing. Obviously, Trindamir healing. Um, so it's going to be really, really beneficial to get some anti healing. Alright, want to be careful here. A nice little hit there. Hold this right under here. I can do one of those. Pop a potion. Hold this under tower. Ready for battle. Only downside with Tima is it kind of auto pushes uh, your wave, so it's a little harder to freeze. I have no idea where Trindamir is. So just cause him to lose as much minions as I can by holding the wave. Got my freeze nice and set up. So 39 to 36. There's a cannon minion he missed though. Make sure I don't miss mine. I got my level 6, so if he shows up, I want to fight him while I have ultimate and he does not. Nice. If I see him appear on the map, I want a hard shove too. Just give him a nice little love tap there. Gotta be careful, I don't have vision. No 
point using my E just yet. Probably gonna shove this in. Yep, and I can get Rift Scuttler and get some deep vision for Jarvan. Grab this, and I can grip this plant on my way back too. Nice. Surprise! Cool. Definitely gonna be a ninja tabby game as well, as long as I don't get hit by too many snares. So this is where the matchup gets a little bit tricky, um, because of Trinomir's ultimate. You gotta kinda whittle him down. You don't wanna engage too hard because he's strongest when he's lowest. So like right now, Trinomir is really strong because he has a full rage bar there. This is gonna slow push out to me, so no point in getting too aggressive. I don't have a spot to teleport to. Well, got that kill there, so that's good. So I said, I don't want to engage on him here. I want to be able to poke him down a little bit first, but I don't have any lane priority. Don't forget with Conqueror, the way it works is you need to auto attack and give yourself four seconds to re engage, and then your next auto attack procs it. So now I could potentially engage on him. He should have his flash up, so I gotta be careful. But that's the kind of thing I wanna do, but not let him resustain back up. So if he backed, if he stays, I wanna let him slow push. If he finishes the back, cool. Hard shove. Oh, did he stop it? What a jerk. <laughs> I'll take it. 2v1. 2 1. So I'm in a good spot. I want to start building towards my Trinity Force, grab a pair of boots, and then I'll have just enough time for a cloth armor by the time I'm back up. Should have just saved my flash. That's probably the one mistake I made on that play. Perfect. Uh. Let's see, three. Should slow push back out this way because the reinforcements are hitting right now. Yeah, I think I'm okay. Save my TP. Cause yeah, what's it? Three, four versus five, three. Yeah, more minions on this side. This minion's gonna die now. And we'll push forward. Okay, there's his team at. Like I said, I had a feeling that that would be his build. And like me, that's going to make him push harder. That's a good time to fight him. Oh, yeah! Good stuff, Shaco. He did not want to die. That lasts so long. Oh god, I forgot about his ult! Oh, he should have him. I'll take it. <laughs> Get my ninja tabby. Trade him moves teleporting. So I could teleport back too. That was my bad. I could have easily saved that. I still think I'm playing the matchup pretty well though. Alright, that's gonna shove back out to me thanks to his Tiamat. Like, he hits one of these and watch, like, boom. Cool. So, oh, let's see what's happening down here. I can come in. Nice. Cool. 
get this tower. Nice. Good stuff. Since I can't get back to top tower in time, I just want to take this tower. So sacrifice top and bottom, we should get first tower, yeah. Nice. Cool. The TP plays. That's one thing that I think I could definitely improve on as a top laner, is I don't make TP plays to the bot lane nearly enough, but that one was good. Head back to the top lane. I think Shaker will have a hard time against the Trindomir. So I'm going to get my Sheen next. That's going to give me some extra poking damage. Because I want to go for quick pokes against Trindomir and Windle and down. The faster I can get him to use his alt and disengage, slash re-engage, the better. Yeah, it's going to be a little bit of a tough matchup because all the engage that they have. Like, the Jarvan engage is real. Good job by the Ari to survive. I should be back in time to save this. Nice. Good job, Shaco. Good job, Shaco. Get this Rift Skulder right here. Give myself some vision again. I'm a lot stronger than the Trindomir right now, too, so I really want to pressure this lead against him. ultimate. Cool. Get some vision up over here. Pop my next potion. Because if he stays, I should be able to dive him then. Or get some pressure on this tower if he leaves. So you have to hold your E a lot more than you initially expect it. And that's, that's kind of the key there. And then once he pops his ultimate, I leave. And then I would, you know, re-engage if he stayed. Let's pop another potion here. I got enough vision where I should be able to... I don't know. Yep. I'll say I don't know if there's help or not, so... I will back. Nice. Surprise, Grab a jungle back. camp here. Should be able to stick around. Alright. Going for Hydra probably first. Could be a little. This is a tough spot for me right now. I don't think I can stay. Ooh, good job. Oh, I'm fine. Get these. That's not okay. If he has ultimate or not, I gotta leave. If he has ultimate, I'll die. Give up that tower. That's fine. I can get... I'm gonna grab my last bit of gold and get, so I can get my... Really? You're still here? There you go. Now I got it back. Trendomir. Okay. Gonna be greedy. Don't be that greedy. I need 30 gold for my Trinity Force. It's too big of a buy to not get it. Oh god. Oh, they got Rift Herald. See ya. Man. Team is not doing so good. That's what I was afraid of. The team fights start breaking out. Jarvan initiation echoes really hard to kill, but I got a match, you know Bring it on. Trindomir split push We'll see We'll see Scary Scary Let's see Nice. 
nice. Nice. Three. Two. Back it up. Nice. Someone's got to cover trend. Like, get my bramble. I'm gonna need it against. I'm gonna need it too badly against Trindamir and uh, someone's going. I'm gonna try and get this tower real quick. There's his ultimate. I was just gonna do too much damage. Help get this infernal. Pop a potion. No alts, Trindamir. Pop my potions. Take this real quick. Can't handle the jacks. Don't worry, guys. I got it. <laughs> nice heals, nice support. Try to have quick feet and dance around a little bit, but good stuff. Good stuff. Um, I'm gonna go for Sterix next, I think. Grab that. I got top. Yeah. Tridomir can't do anything about me. I'm 10 and 2. I am huge. Your team has destroyed a turret. So, Tridomir's not going to be able to stop me at all now. I'll be able to jump on him in a second. my potions. Faded! <laughs> I'm dead. There's nothing I can do there. If Karma wasn't there, I think I could have had it. Oh, Shaco's getting free damage. I don't think that'll give me enough. Nope. When I get my Sterics, I'll be in an infinitely better position. Sterics ran to one's omen. I did not want to give Jarvan that shutdown gold. Lame. Yikes. They need a group. Clear a camp real quick, and then I can get my Sterics. I think I need to keep with my team because they're just gonna die without me. Need Baron Vision. Turned to me red flash for that play too. So I'm just gonna start pushing towers out. I mean, uh, waves out, and then. I want to get my Sterics. That's going to help me with the tenacity as well. Perfect. Cool. On my way! Yeah, I think uh, sticking with the team is going to be really important. Just because they're going to die anyways. Nice, Baron, Baron. Not how I expected that to go, but good stuff by the Shaco. 
I'll take it. That play by the Echo was really, really stupid. Find my potions. Find my other ones. What are you gonna? Idiots. Okay. I think we could have easily gotten um, Baron, but okay. They would have stayed on it. I'm gonna push down, push this wave. I'm gonna finish my Titanic and then get Omen. The slow is gonna be really nice. Let's see here. Push top. I got TP. I see Echo. I right, start making my way towards the team. Like I said, I don't really trust them, so. There's Jarvan. Trendimir's answering my top push. I can push mid in. Just let Shaco get top tower. Back it up. We got nice vision for Baron, so. They gotta be careful. I said, I, Trindamir can't kill me unless I play it really, really poorly. The way that they die is they get initiated on by Jarvan, so as long as they don't let that happen, then Ready for battle. cut Trindamir off. We see, uh, we see Jarvan top, so... We should hard engage right now. Nice. Nice. Perfect. Scrub dragon. Grab mid then dragon. Yep, I agree. Mid then dragon. They don't have an ADC, so I got flashy if I need it. Get the inhib, then we get the dragon. Cool. Baron the dragon, maybe? Yeah. Mm. You're going to commit to it. I think we're okay. As long as Jarvan doesn't take it, be ready for my... <laughs> Pro Flash! <laughs> A cloud fiesta, I'm gonna go by. Grab that and grab some health for Omen. Yeah, because that'll help me against the magic damage too. We can push down the towers, take some more objectives. Hi, yeah, yeah, yeah.
What a game. <laughs> I said, Trinomir's been pretty much rendered useless, so I'm pretty satisfied by that. I think uh, other games have made the mistake of not grouping with the team faster. I did a much better job at that. This game made some juicy bot lane plays. I'm on my way. Oh, this Jin is doing work. GG. My goodness. Yeah, you just gotta know the, the right times to fight Trindomir and how to disengage and engage on him with your E. If you do that properly, it's it's not an easy matchup, but it's not a terribly hard matchup either. <laughs> GG. Yeah, pretty good matchup. Like I said, I think I did a really good job of grouping when I needed to and then splitting against the Trindomir. If the Trindomir had been stronger, that could have gone a lot worse, though. Um, when he was splitting top, but I think uh, I think it worked really, really well. And I do think you got to do a good job of looking at the team comps and what you need to do. Like, Karma speed up, Jarvan initiation, slow, stun. Um, they just have so much initiation. What disengage do we have? We have a, a Jin that has no disengage at all, so it's not like Ezreal who can kite or anything like that. Um... Ari can kind of get away, but if they get on top of our squishies, they're just going to die. So, me getting into team fights definitely allowed us to win that one. Let's check the damage charts here. Oh, I think I hard carried that one. Well, I hope you guys like that one. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, all that good jazz. Um, my Twitch streaming info in the description as well. Come hang out while we record, and I'll catch you guys next time. Peace.